G'day. Early in 2022, I took a long drive out west to visit my mate Phil at his new property in the Western Downs region of Queensland. Since then, I have a lot of new subscribers who very likely haven't seen the video, and it was my longest vlog ever. So I thought I'd make a shorter, recut version of some of the highlights of the trip and what we got up to. And now, whilst I'm talking, please take a second now to make sure that you've subscribed and that the all notifications bell is enabled. And give it a like, as those things do help my tiny channel to get out there. There is a link to the full video from start to finish down below and in the end screen of this one. So, for the benefit of both my new subscribers and of course my small band of loyal followers to revisit my journey, which includes some never before seen footage, please sit back and enjoy this new condensed version of my memorable visit. In 700 metres, be in either of the two right lanes, then keep right onto Warrego Highway. Yeah, this is bringing back memories uh, of many motorbike rides backwards and forwards. Back in my early 20s. About every two weeks I'd ride my motorbike out here. Then again I had a girlfriend out here at the time too, so I had a little bit of motivation. So I'm going to stop and top up the tank uh, at Dalby and my mate Phil, who you, you will meet, you've seen in a still photo I've put up on the community tab, is actually meeting me somewhere along the road to show me a 15 minute shortcut to his place. So yeah, look forward to that. Haven't seen him for, is it a year and a half or nearly two years? I can't believe how quickly time goes, but anyway, that's the way life is. So yeah, catch you back once we've filled up. just pulled over. I'm now in Dolby which is, uh, I don't know, it's about 70 something kilometres, which is around about 50 miles I suppose from Phil's house. I'm just going to scull a very quick coffee. My second one on the trip. Henry II over there he is of course behaving immaculately. Beautiful. In fact uh, yeah, I'm not even uh, doesn't even feel like it's that far to have driven after all, after all these months of stressing about how far it is, but no, it's running beautifully. I'd like to say it's a Ford and that's why, but man, I don't know. <laughs> I'm, I'm not so confident these days, but no, she's running lovely. I'm just going to drink this really quickly and hit the road because it's way, way later than I originally planned to be out here, but it's kind of also about the time I thought I'd end up here. Yeah. Well, I had this phone sticky tape to the car um, windscreen, which is not the most high tech of things, but anyway, it worked. And uh, yeah, <laughs> it, whatever works, eh? So yeah, I hope you're able to see like the familiar to me. Uh, haven't seen for probably 35 years since I've been out this way. The I don't know what they're harvesting at the moment, sorghum or whatever, but it's changed a bit. Until I speak to you in a few seconds. Cheers, and I'll see you back on the road. We're almost there. Welcome to the West. Well, I'm not far now. So to give you a quick look at what things are like here. Quietest road so far, actually. <laughs> Thank you. 
a panther in the yard there clearly a dangerous wild animal versus that one standing next to the car there clearly a dangerous wild car <laughs> I'm apparently going for a drive before we have coffee let's go and check out the cat who's apparently quite adventurous goes in kayaks and everything oh come back black cat come here yeah you ever seen one of these? Nope. That's why she doesn't want to see one now either. Ah. Ah, pigs. Well, turn around, pigs. Because you know if you turned around. Pigs' ass. Pigs' ass. Pigs' ass! Hey, Porky. Do they have names or? They're just called Future Bacon. Okay? It's Kevin. <laughs> Kevin. Bacon. Kevin Bacon. Yeah, another one. I can't remember. <laughs> that hand's name. Okay. Look at this next door's place. Oh, is it? Okay. Dash jam. Yeah, it's warmer now I'm at the car. It's, it's warmer out of my car. It was 16 degrees all the way up here. Until I got out of the car. See? Oh no, I forgot my seatbelt. Oh, uh, uh. And my bum cushion. <laughs> How's your bum cushion, Phil? My bum cushion's fine. Oh, okay. That's my missus. <laughs> my bum cushion's alright considering the trip up. Oh, this is the one that's damn. Good. Oh, sugar. Um, yellow belly in it. Ah, oh, wow. Oh, okay. Look at that. Dam. It's got a start pump oh, What a damn big dam. It's actually about Camera a megalitre. Well, this duck come out of it from around. Megalitre? Well, that's nearly like a million litres, isn't it? <laughs> like them, <laughs> I just like saying Merga. Merga Oh. Oh, well, right. Sorry. <laughs> oh, everyone duck. Let's have a wee squiz. I just got to start it. Oh, starting up the pump. All right, hang on. Now right, we're going to have a look at the starting up of the pump here. It's five o'clock in the afternoon. Look at the lovely sky that I didn't expect. Uh, try and get some drone footage in tomorrow.
probably not best today. There's one of his dams. A going bush. Is that a petroleum product I smell? Or did you just drop yeah, one? Not in your usual Musgrave Park, mate. I don't usually hang out at Musgrave Park, mate. <laughs> I'm the wrong colour, you're closer to that colour with all your sunburn. Sunburn? Or tan. I think it was cooking the bloody curry this morning. Oh, hurry for Cody! Your fingers are even burning from the chilli. Ah. Uh -huh. So the, I could have something else burning by morning then. You said so hot. Yep, I did. <laughs> Actually, I didn't make it hot. <clears throat> well, I used to be used to hot chilli, but not so much these days. So now explain to the whole world that sees this eventually what's going to happen with this pump. It's going to pump water up to the house to water my garden. So this pump. That way. This pump takes it to somewhere. It goes through the bush. Ah. Well, let's see it start up and then we'll follow where it goes from here. That's close enough. Contact. It's a runner. Definitely a runner. See where it goes. A few moments later. And here we are doing this. Here we are doing the speed limit on Phil's property. <laughs> wow! Geez, it reminds me of the first time I ever rode in your old Holden. Now you Commodore. Yeah, that's it. Well, that's a worry. This <laughs> PJ's car is really crushed in his own. Did he? Welcome to live Steve Mac being killed channel. <laughs> I've got you over right I want you now. <laughs> if you're seeing this footage, it means I survived the trip. If you never see this... <laughs> ah, crap. <laughs> okay. I forgot what a driver Phil can be. <laughs> Quiet, Carla. <laughs> This is sort of cut through the middle. This is sort of a dice action of east, west, north, south. Have you ever got lost here? Me? Yeah. When you first bought it? No. No? Oh, I got so I circled on myself when I tried going through all this thick stuff. Yeah. I never got lost. I knew exactly where it was. Just... Yeah. And that's the way you navigate trees. <laughs> yes. uh. And this is the eyesore of the place. Oh, the dump! Yes. Are there any pigs in there? Oh, yeah. So, everybody who's lived here has just dumped their rubbish right here. Really? So, I'm going to hire a dozer, skull it out, yeah. and show yeah. it in the middle. Oh. Whoa! Oh. What the hell is that? That's what you call a differential blowing out of a Ford. <laughs> no, well, it was a short, the short loop. Are you interested? Yeah, I'll take a few, All right. Coffee. Phil wants a coffee, he doesn't realise I've had like 20 on the way here. <laughs> I've been waiting. <laughs> waiting, waiting, walking, walking. <laughs> Still, I don't find him. <laughs> All right. Let's go have a coffee. Don't forget your smokes. No, they're in my pocket, of course. Oh, they? Oh, crap. <laughs>
you prepay. This is only the second time I've done this though. So it may not work. Oh, well, I'll just turn the thing away from your pin number. And then you go down there and you can't zoom and you fill up. And then you come down and you get your fuel and the rest doesn't need explaining, does it, how you get fuel? No. no? You reckon people can understand that? And stay tuned for my next video about how to fill up fuel. Fill? No, fill up fuel, not fill. Fill. You said fill. Oh, oh fuel. And here's the local food works. It's the only place open today. There we go. Civilization. You can even buy X DVDs. Very nice. Went out about 20 years ago, but anyway. Three hours later. Can you move it along? I'm all out of time cards. Well, no fish so far, but there's other adventures to come. Venture. Venture. Well, the windscreen going through my face. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Stupid tree. Mm -hmm. Fancy fucking plant a tree right there. Uh, I know. Oop, another tree behind us. I mean, try not to kill us. Oh, shit. Kangaroos jump out. <laughs> <laughs> Did I mention Phil's a great driver? Sugar. Make sure you subscribe. <laughs> Christ, that's oh. gone out of focus. Oh no, hang on. That might be better. Oh, maybe. Whew. Well, we're back in focus. That right. <laughs> oh, it's going to get muddy in a second. The guy's back wasn't already bad. <laughs> oh, man. I love it. Yeah. Oh, train time. Yeah. Oh, focus. Keep filling. Keep going over the deck. Oh, okay. Yeah. Then we'll go in here. Okay. Oh, my spine. <laughs> oh, oh. <laughs> uh -oh. Sorry if we're losing focus, but better than losing the life. Oh, there's, there's, there's one of his dams there. Damn it. Damn. God. Fucking ah. wood everywhere. Shit. As I've said, the things I do for YouTube, <laughs> it's the dam there that we nearly drove into. It's the fucking hills that people try and climb their four wheel drives. Yeah. Shit. Ah. Because I can't see anything out of the little lens. That's, there you go. Oh, oh yeah. <laughs> Everything's out of focus, the autofocus can't keep up with it. There it is. <coughs> well, this is the most out of focus video I've ever done. Literally can't focus. Where am I aiming at? Because yeah, the windscreen's dirty. No, it's just... <laughs> other reasons. <laughs> Pity I wasn't live streaming then. 
But Steve's gonna die live on camera. Excellent. And then I'll get some views. Posthumously. <sighs> right. Have you got a light in here? No. You guys are like a rocket, eh? Yeah. So I'm guessing nobody can see me, but yes, there's a pleasant little drive thanks to Phil. Yeah, there we go. Take two. Well, I'm guessing nobody could see me, but <laughs> thanks, Phil. What's that smell? <laughs> <laughs> well, it ain't lobsters. Fear. <laughs> or something. <laughs> All good fun. The next day. Hide this little bastard. And this one is going to synchronize sound, so... <coughs> Jeez, you're fat. I'm Phil. Am I in shot? Uh -huh. Can you see me on the screen? Oh. A bit. No, 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 this Oh, kind of. It's right in the meter. Oh. Take is, one. Everything is how I... This is ad lib. Let me just move that a bit so we get... I'm going to pick up the other one. I brought a lapel mic, but... Oh, is, uh, well, I'm going to put this here, hide it. Oh. Yeah, that's what I mean. Oh, I'm recording already, haven't I? Looks like it. No, this one. Okay. Now, this will all be spontaneous. Okay, sound and speed. That's for me, so I can signalise that later. And that's it. <laughs> well, I don't know. Well, I was, thought it was about time I introduced you to Angie, who's uh, the best catch Phil's ever had, that's for sure. And I was thinking, you know, mate... Got the right bite! You did! <laughs> I was just pondering how to say this, but I've just calculated. It's been 30 years, give or take a few months, since we met. Do you believe that? I don't, know. Any stories we could tell you would take about 20 hours, and we'd probably only take you about... Tell you about two or three stories. Just want to cut it down to yeah. out, party, drink, vomit. <laughs> That's it. That's it. Come Just home. Most everything else you can't say anything. <laughs> so how did you find this fella? You don't have to admit the truth. You can make it up. Hairdressing. Yeah. Stumbled, stumbled across him. What, was he laying on the floor? No. Mm. Oh, uh, well, okay. Not at that stage. There's another story we can't go into. Anyway. Thank you both Angie and Phil for having me here. And uh, we're going to check the Abbey traps and do a bit of fishing. Yes. All right. Yeah. Let's go do I it. must say. Yes? What? To be what? <laughs> yeah, what? You're not going to pick your bait. <laughs> yeah, another no, story. It's, just it's good to see you here. You too. Finally. I know. It's been, been a long time planning. Well, you guys may have seen a picture of us at Phil's party, which was, what, nearly two years ago? Over two years ago now. Yeah. 9th of January we moved in here, two years ago. Time just disappears. Right. Yes. Oh. The plan is though, yeah. just back, back to your yabbies, oh, yeah. you're told we're having for dinner. Oh yeah, mm. well, what are we having for dinner, Edge? Mm, fresh yabbies. And where do they come from, Edge? Oh, straight from our front dam. Oh, well let's go check that out. <laughs> that was a good way <laughs> <up. laughs> oh, no. That's that was all me. <laughs> it was. Okay, we'll cut there. I'm not camera shy though. No, me neither. Damn it, I forgot to turn the camera on. <laughs> I think that'll do nicely. And I'll keep the camera rolling to get all the good outtakes. <laughs> now, this is dinner for tonight. I'm sure we have a one. Oh! <laughs> Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> Just check that again. Woo. Oh. oh, they're attached. They're a couple. Let's go see where they came from. All right. All right. We know where they're going. I, sus er, I suspect I do. I really shouldn't have this around the neck, should I? There you go. I suspect where they're going to end up. Put him in the curry! And that great big thing that you saw yesterday when, when, when I met Phil looking at the windscreen it was disgusting. My guts. Oh. <laughs> oh, 
thought you were talking about the concrete septic tank. That's really good. No, 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 something else. <laughs> so, these came from the traps we checked just the afternoon. Oh, it's a bit muddy here. Yeah. The rain's kind of stopped. Oh, it does get slippery. The rain has stopped and started again. <coughs> Forgive my usual wheezing. Right. So, we'll look on the string there. Any? Oh, cool. Awesome. Oh. And a mini fish. Mini fish. That's a baby yellow belly. Oh. Fingering. What? It's a fingerling. Oh, I should have said finger him. Right, <laughs> <laughs> back to the crab pot. Oh, yeah, we put. Now I've got ants attacking my legs. Oh, there you go. Three out of that one. Not enough. Well, they will let up. And explain what you're telling me why you put them into the water, because it'll wipe the ants off my feet. Uh, well, if they're in muddy water, when they get out of the water, they close the wheels off straight away. Yep. And they get a muddy flavour if you don't mm. let them rest in the like rain water. This way they purge overnight. Yeah. Clever little things. Purge. That's the there we go. word for the day. They don't know what's coming, do they? <laughs> I'm still checking another trap. This is the first time I'm walking away from you. This is the third time you broke something new. There's a few traps around and they all add up.
Later that same evening. A little visitor that just jumped out, Phil. A little visitor just jumped out from under the thing there. Yeah. Green frog. Yeah. Put him in the curry. Yes, <laughs> we can put him in the curry. <laughs> uh, okay. Well, you guys will see what we're going to curry shortly. The Chinese have been doing it for billions of years. I literally almost forgot to show you the end result of those little fellas in the pot this morning. Phil's end result has some shells. There's Angie's leftover shells. That's gone. <laughs> and uh, this is all totally, would you call it Does organic? Because Angie grows her own noodles. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, I had to add that. Anyway, it's very tasty. Thank you, Phil. That's a thumbs up. I don't know if I'm pointing the right way. Epilogue. I want to thank you all for watching. I hope it's been a bit of a laugh and a bit of entertainment. And a special thank you, of course, to Phil and Angie for tolerating me. So, much appreciated. I'll see you all next time. Cheers.